good. Yep. 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 Good morning. We are down on the Tennessee Georgia border. I was invited here by Jeremiah. Join a few of uh, a few of his friends. Got to do a little trip around here. Uh, last night I slept in the back of the Forerunner for the first time. I didn't feel like bringing the trailer or the tent. So uh, let me show you the setup. There's actually quite a lot of room in the back here. Down here I've got uh, bedding. Got my winter sleeping bag. And then, I can't remember the name of this mattress, but it's self-inflating, and it's super comfortable. It's got some kind of foam padding in the inside. Really, really good, and it fits perfectly in the back of the floor. And I'll put a link to it so you can find it. The Cahutta and Big Frog Wilderness on the Tennessee and Georgia border is looped by about 80 miles of trail. Our goal was to drive the whole thing. What's going on? What's all the drama? I don't know. Come here. Oh, that would have been awesome. I was just you Channel blew out. Ooh. The whole warning was coming off. It was just they're, they're flopping. Just flopping yeah. Wow. Well, you've got a. Uh, there's two forest rangers behind us. Not neither of them smiled. I walked up to them and said, "You know, we just got a little trail side repair. And we'll try and get it done quickly." This yeah. deadpan stare at me. A short distance along the trail was Tumbling Creek, where John got his fly fishing gear out. He wasn't having much luck, so we continued on our way. We didn't make it far before coming across the blockage.
camp we got the fire going and the food cooking. There was a lot of meat. A ton of chicken, venison and beef. I've had venison before when I lived in England, but it didn't compare to this food. Maybe American deer are tastier, maybe it's because this was cooked better, but the food was amazing.